Okay, Suzanne, so now we're in our costumes. We've got our nipple pasties ready to go, and we're going to learn how to twirl our tassels. So the first thing to learn is something called a shoulder shimmy. So you want to just have the arms to the side of the body, lifting them up to the waist level, having them slightly bent, and it's very important that you finish with beautiful burlesque fingers so you have the thumb down the index finger up the two middle fingers down and the little finger up so just try to imagine a beautiful ballerina a beautiful dancer what would her hands look like while she's dancing and try to just have your hands in a beautiful formation and you want to keep your arms strong and the fingers strong you don't want to be flipping and flopping around with the arms and the hands. The only flipping and flopping around is the breasts and the pasties, not the arms. Okay, so keep the arms firmly to the side. Mm -hmm. Right. So now let's look at the shoulders. So you want to really push the shoulders back. Imagine your pasties are now pointing right up to the ceiling. Right up. We don't want droopy pasties. No, 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 no. Up, 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 up. Think pointing to the ceiling. <laughs> Wonderful, Suzanne. That's it. <laughs> nice and perky there. Mm -hmm. Okay, now we're going to push one shoulder forward and one shoulder back. Ready? One forward, one back. And then alternate the shoulders. The other one goes forward. The other one goes back. Push forward. Push back. Push forward. Push back. That's it. Now try to keep your arms at the side of your body. Do not move the arms. It should be just the shoulders and the chest moving from left to right. Left to right. That's it. Now, how to get those tassels twirling? We've got to speed it up and we've got to shake it. Are you ready? From mm -hmm. left and right, pushing the shoulders forward and back, and let's shake it. Ready? One, two, three, go! Shake it! Shake it! Shake it! <laughs> Wonderful! You did it! Oh, my... Amazing. <laughs> Wonderful job. Okay, now I have one more tassel technique for you. Um, so this is forming an um, clockwise circle and an anti-clockwise circle. Mm -hmm. So now we're going to do um, a different formation of circles. And this time we're going to put our arms above our head, right up just slightly bent and then finish at the top again with beautiful fingers bring the hands together um, to the outside um, hands facing outwards and just try to create beautiful shapes with the fingers that's right and then you're going to bring your legs together standing up nice and straight and you're going to bend the knees. Now, bending your knees will allow you to bounce up and down. So this up and down will create the circles. And you really have to bounce, not jumping, but bouncing. Mm -hmm. Okay, we ready? One, two, three, and bounce. Go! <laughs> Amazing. She's doing it. She's doing it. Wonderful. <laughs> Thank you. I wish there was an audience here to give you a round of applause. I hope all the listeners at home just give Suzanne a round of applause. She did an amazing job. <laughs> okay, so I think uh, we deserve a glass of champagne yeah, after yeah. that, don't we? Uh -huh. Here we go. Got one over here, all ready to go. So cheers, Suzanne. Cheers and thank you again for this wonderful lesson, Lady Lou. You're very welcome. I always have so much fun when I come here to Radio Impala and I really can't wait for the next time. So thank you very much for having me and thank you for listening.